am in Dollar Tree and I came in here because I opened up my bathroom cabinet and it is just really a mess and I've got to do something about organization. So I came in here to find some things to organize with and I thought I'd take you with me. So let's go see what they got. So the one that I saw some teachers with the other day, they got a bunch of them. I should have turned around then and came and got some because they were in. <sighs> but they're all gone now. So I got those and I'm gonna make those work. And um, I'm not gonna do go from Dollar Tree to Dollar Tree looking for them. So we'll see what I do with those. Maybe tonight when I get off from work, because I'm always, I always have to wind down. So maybe tonight when I get off work, we'll organize under the sink. See you then. Hey family, I made it home. The last time I talked to you, it was, I don't know, maybe one o'clock, 1.15 in the afternoon. Well, Can you see that? 3.27 in the morning. Just got in. I'm gonna make me a cup of coffee. How y'all doing? Hope you're just having a good day. When you see this, I know it's three in the morning, but I hope that when you see this, you're having a good day. I am finally off from work. I'm gonna tell you, the night was a night, y'all. You know, I have to pray for to be mild and meek tempered because everybody that I deal with doesn't come at me the way I want, doesn't come, doesn't talk to me the way they want to be talked to. Some of them can be disrespectful. And I'm going to have to pray continuously that it's not that I'm disrespectful back but my tone lets people know that they can't talk to me any kind of way but I'm still gotta be mindful sometimes you just gotta say less or Bring your tone down a little bit, even though people are being loud and disrespectful, you can't ever give them a reason to say, well, she, you know, she, I didn't like the way she talked to me, or 
I just recognize that I need to work on meekness. And I need to work on how I respond. And I need to pray more <laughs> when I'm working before I speak. I wasn't disrespectful to him. A associate was disrespectful to me. And I, I kind of had some authority in my tone. But afterward, but his reaction to how I spoke to him was not what I expected because of how he spoke to me. And so, you know, it caused me to feel uneasy when I got off from work. It caused me, when I was walking to my car in the parking lot, I don't ever want to have the wrong thoughts about how people are going to react to me or treat me or retaliate but that's how I felt tonight and I don't want to feel like that so I'm going to work on meekness and I'm going to do the best that I can to do my part and that's all I can do I'm making coffee I know most of you are going to be saying coffee at 3 in the morning and you're probably trying to wind down coffee is how I wind down I don't drink coffee for ca caffeine. I don't drink caffeine. I drink decaf. So, I got some packages. Well, I got a bunch of packages. See those big boxes over there? But I know what those are. Over there is a curtain rod and um, some drapes that I got for the bedroom. And I'm not ready to put them up yet, so I haven't opened them. But this box is some randomness. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it. So you guys know that I just got a UV light. Well, the company sent me another one to review. So I'm probably going to give my cousin mine D3 vitamins. I haven't taken them in so long, and I need to be taking them. So I'm going to, I told you this is a box of randomness. I'm going to go ahead and add them to my pill pack that I keep in my work in my purse, I started taking my pill pack to work with me, hopefully to remember to take my pills. It didn't work tonight. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to, um, but I'm gonna take a D3. They look like that. I'm going to take one of those. And even though it's three in the morning, I'm going to take my evening blood pressure pill because it's my evening. And this will get, keep my blood pressure steady throughout the night. My husband got some replacement, the clips that your iPhone go in. I got him some of those. And this is a cute little romper. My cousin got one in blue. And I got the pink. I got the pink. And I actually got this in an extra large and I don't know if I'm ready for an extra large. So we are going to try it on right now and see. I've been wanting to try it on all day. So this is an extra large. Hers is really loose on hers. Hers is an extra large too. And it's really, really loose. Mine isn't bad. Not bad. I got into an extra large, y'all. I don't like the way it looks on me though. Hers is really loose on her. I guess mine is loose on me too. What do you think? 
What do y'all think? I feel like, oh, it's got pockets. I feel like it looked like pajamas on me. I don't know. What do you think? I would run to Walmart in this. I would. What you think? I know. Big booty Judy. Five more pounds and I'll be a little more comfortable in it. But I think it's cute and comfortable and roomy. She's tall, so they're like capris on her. But they go to my ankles. But I like it. I'm just excited that I got into an extra large. So cute. Be right back. So cute, you guys. So anyway, that's what I got from Amazon. I got these today at Dollar Tree. You were with me. I'm so tired, y'all. But maybe we can just go in and see what they're going to look like. How can I carry y'all? I can't. I'll see y'all in there. Be right back. Okay. So, I went and got the bath and body stuff that I ordered. It was still in my office. And I think that, well, these hand sanitizers, but they can sit in there. I think this bin will be for body care. And then I also started this one for face care. And everything in here is for my face. Everything in here is for my face. Shave gel. Face sunscreen. So I put the containers down there and filled them with stuff. But I got so much stuff that, that it just, it's not, it, it just looks like a crowded mess. So I'm going to pull everything out. Figure out what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to get rid of and how to best organize those containers. I may have to get some more of those stands so I can have some on the top, some on the bottom, but this just isn't gonna work. So we'll figure it out. But we can't figure it out after working 12 hours, cause I work 12 hours a night. So I'm just gonna get ready for bed and try to wind down y'all. And um, call it a night because tomorrow is another 12-hour day. And therefore, I need to get some rest. So, I love you guys. I'm thinking of you. That's the main reason that I wanted to turn on the camera. Because I said I was going to do something earlier. And I try to do what I say I'm going to do. But I'm just tired and um, not going to be able to do it tonight. And I'm probably going to post this as is because who knows when I'll be able to do it. I just want to show you I tried. I love you all. I hope you're having a wonderful week. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.